السلام علیکم الحمد للہ اشاد و اللہ الہ الا اللہ و اشاد و انہ محمد عبدہ و رسول ہو پتہ ہی نہیں لگا دوستا روزے آر کمنگ اور روزے آر گوئنگ نہ ٹوڈے آئی ہاو اسپیشل ڈیش فور یو گائز نہ دس اس پیری پیری چکن دو وی آئی لائک ایک گنے بی یوزنگ دا مسالہز بچ آر آویلیبل آر ہوم بر دو وی آئی مکس دیز مسالہز اور دو وی آئی کوک دیز چکن ایک گیوز دیت آثنٹی Perry Perry flavor so this chicken will be marinated and it will be put in the fridge for a few hours so the chicken can absorb in all the flavors and the masalas and then I will be cooking it under the grill and just you know smoking it and cooking it straight through so let's start off with the ingredients for the ingredients you're gonna need some chicken obviously it's a Perry Perry chicken so here I have a kilo of chicken um, I'm using chicken on the bone because I think that gives it more flavor. Um, here I have one tomato, I have one onion, um, I've got chilies, lemon, I've got some yogurt, and then here I've got some salt, some grand zira, some tandoori masala, some peppers, some olive oil, and we've got some original Nando Peri Peri sauce. Now this sauce is not going to be used at the moment. This is going to be used at the end when we finish the chicken off. If you don't have this sauce, it's no big deal, but it is something that I recommend. So it's time to marinate this amazing Peri Peri chicken dish by yours truly, BDN Vlogs, the wrong chef. We smash it burgers, baby. Guys, we're gonna start off by adding the raw ingredients. The tomato, the onion, and the green chilies are gonna go straight into the, the mix. I wanna add the lemon, squeeze half a lemon, catching the, the seeds in your hands. I wanna add some salt. some zira, some tandoori masala. I want to add some oil to it. Give that a good mix. Now that's mixed, I want to add a tablespoon of yogurt. a nice mix like that. I want to add the peppers. Good amount of pepper. Give that a mix. Add some more peppers boys. Guys, now that is the marinade mixed. This is ready. As you guys can see, that looks really nice. And it smells gorgeous. So this is gonna go into the fridge for a few hours. Um, so the chicken absorbs and sucks in all the juices and everything. And then I'm gonna be cooking this under the grill, boys. Welcome back, guys. It's been a few hours. Chicken's marinated. So I've made the tray ready. I've got the tray, I've got the foil underneath it, and I put the grease paper on top. Just gonna add the chicken straight to the tray with all the juices, just like that. And put that straight into the, the grill. Push it in. Now we're gonna cook that chicken under the grill on a high heat, full grill, high heat, every five, six minutes, 10 minutes, we're gonna toss and turn the chicken, toss and turn the chicken, until the chicken is nice, golden, and cooked straight through. 
Guys, it's been about 10 minutes now, so we're gonna take the chicken out, check it, turn it around, put it back in. Guys, we gotta pull the chicken out again, toss it over, check it out. So that's the second time I've done that. I'm gonna do that three, four times, and then the next time I see you, I'm gonna see you when the chicken is ready to be drizzled with the peri peri sauce. Guys, the chicken is looking good now. Um, I've tossed it and turned it quite a few times. It's all browned off, it's dried off. Let's take it out and let's finish it off. I'm gonna get the peri peri sauce. I just want to lightly drizzle it over, mix the chicken in like that, mix it in with the sauce, I want to add a little bit more peri peri sauce, not too much, just a little bit, just like that. Want to get some yogurt? Just add a little bit of yogurt like that to the mix, just to finish it off. Give that a little light mix. Nothing special, just a light one. Once that's mixed like that, put it back into the grill for about five six minutes staying on the chicken, tossing and turning it. Now it's very important that we stay on the chicken and we keep on moving it. We don't want to leave it in the grill and go away. You want to pull it out, turn it around, put it back in, pull it out, turn it around, put it back in two, three times, and then the chicken is ready. Guys, as I said, quickly gonna take the chicken out, just like that. Turn all over. Now if that looks a little bit dry to you, you want to add some olive oil, this is extra virgin olive oil, right at the end that is, just to give it that shine, mix the oils in, it's back into the grill. Guys chicken is ready, let's pull it out. Look at that, that looks nice, juicy, peri peri. Let's go to mom's house and open the rosa. Just entering mom's house. Anna's not here today, it's only a slot. Yes boys, mashallah, rosa is open. Let me show you the menu. Peri peri chicken, samosas, boiled rice, and beef mince. Starting off with the samosas, dip that into the Special Algerian sauce. <coughs> that's my Algerian sauce. Peri peri chicken. Start off with this. With nice juicy Thai peri peri. Yeah man, you get that peri peri kick to it. I definitely. Do. Well, we've got the nice peri peri again. I'm gonna dip that into my special Algerian sauce. Today with less people, normally we have two families here. One family is missing, well, three families. A nephew and I'm not. It's really quiet without the minute. It's more hot. Crispy smells right.
Let's try some chowl with the peri peri. It was good, man. Guys, iftar is done. Time for salah. Guys, Alhamdulillah, Ramadan is flying, man. Time is going. The rosé are really short as well. Not really long. The house is really quiet today. No Amna, no nephew, no sister. Normally they're here and trust me, Dosta, roll it. Amna's belief is everywhere. Messing about, Amnab is messing about, we be messing about with Amna and nephew. There's a lot going on, but these three people missing and the Billy four. Really, really, really quiet. Um, basically, yeah, I've got parents even tomorrow. I'm gonna finish at 6.45, so I'm stuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a bit. Guys, tea time. It's too quiet today. It's too quiet here, mum. No nephew, no I'm not. We were just on the phone with nephew and I'm not. Put the phone down, it's gone quiet again. I think the chai, the tea is very important. And chai pure bandega sar sahi ho jata. That's the iftar coming to an end boys. I hope you guys enjoyed the vlog today. That chicken peri peri recipe is a personal recipe to me. And it is, trust me, you need to try that. You try that recipe, follow that recipe and you will know what I'm talking about. That is the best homemade peri peri style chicken you can do. Alhamdulillah, tomorrow I am cooking again. Mom said she's not in the mood of cooking. So I said, why not? I will cook. Alhamdulillah, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, La ilaha illa la, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, illa ilhamd. Ashadu an la ilaha illallah wa ashadu anna muhammadan abdahu wa rasulahu Alhamdulillah, rosé are going fast boys They're flying We don't know how the time is going man So I just pray to Allah SWT that Allah SWT blesses all of you Allah SWT blesses everyone in this blessed month Showers you all with his rahmah and his mercy And all the people that are struggling and going through hardship right now in the world that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala blesses them and makes life easy for them. All the deceased, the dead, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless them and make their life in the hereafter easy for them as well. Hopefully, inshallah, I'm going to see you guys now tomorrow when we're smashing burgers, baby. We're not smashing burgers. 